Hello Movie Box, it's being called the next evolution of the Marvel Cinematic Universe. And based on the movie, Ant-Man is off to a good start. Like Iron Man before it, Marvel goes back to its roots of science and technology for Ant-Man. And like Iron Man, Ant-Man is not one of the most popular characters in the Marvel library, but be prepared to be entertained. It's going to be chaos. A big reason to watch the movie is Paul Rudd. He embodies the aw shucks, reckless charisma of other actors turned superheroes like Robert Downey Jr. Rudd, who also co-wrote the script, is our Ant-Man. But before he embraces his inner hero, he's a con man named Scott Lang. Second chances don't come around all that often. Michael Douglas, making his first superhero movie, stars as Dr. Hank Pym, the inventor of Pym particles that can shrink the wearer of a special protective suit down to the size of, what else, an ant. You should be able to shrink and grow on a dime. Pym hires Scott to keep his technology from falling into the wrong hands and eventually becomes his mentor. We charge big. I also enjoyed Evangeline Lilly's character of Hope. She's Pym's daughter and will materialize in future Marvel movies. At its simplest form, the movie's main crux is idealists are heroes and greedy industrialists are evil. We've seen this so many times before in so many different forms in so many Marvel movies. But Ant-Man is self-aware and uses humor and relatability of its hero, so you'll come along for the ride. He's just a guy. You know, he wasn't born with any kind of superhero ability. To be honest, I thought this movie would be bad. Its original director, Edgar Wright, left due to creative differences. So I was surprised that Peyton Reed, the guy who gave us Bring It On and the lackluster The Breakup, was able to come up with an entertaining yarn. Ant-Man is not as big in scope as Marvel's The Avengers, but this little hero that could may leave a big dent in your fanboy heart. Wait for the closing credits for two big surprises. And for that, Ant-Man gets three big kisses. So there you have it, movie buffs. Big things come in small packages. I'm Ant-Manny, the movie guy.